Hey guys, what's up? I'm so excited to be here at Yakia. They have a brand new location in Los Angeles and we're trying it out. So I am in like Pasadena area right now and we're gonna get some omakase and drinks. We have a reservation for 4.30. Here we go. Cheers. Bottoms up. So this will be the YouTube mm. oh, That's so refreshing. Like a really good start to the meal. Probably love me. So this will be your first old course, which is our 8-5 white you with truffle oil and ponzu jelly. And for this, all in one cup. Okay. okay. Cheers. Mm. Mm. Oh. That's definitely making all my senses tingle right now. I'm going crazy. Okay. And this will be your uh, second rock horse, which is the ribeye tataki smoked in cherry wood with a little bit of garlic powder. Okay. <laughs> oh, oh. What? Right. Wow. Yeah, it was really smoky, but had like a little bit of a chew to it. So despite how small it was, it was actually kind of filling. This is going to be your first raw fish, which is our bluefin tuna tartlet all the way from Spain. And on top of that will be a Ocentra caviar, which is a dash of 24 karat uh, gold flakes as well. And it's still so awesome. All right. Real true luxury right now. Cheers. There's a lot of texture with that one. That's what I noticed, like right off the bat, a lot of texture, a lot of things that are like moving around. Um, I, my favorite part is the tart, the little like crisp part. It's kind of like a, a chip, but not even a chip. Yeah. What do you think it's made of? Will be your last raw horse, which is the hamachi with passion fruit and some yuzu peppers on top. So it is going to have a little bit of a cake to it. Oh, okay. But this here will be. This one will be another palate cleanser or your compressed melons with a carbonated matcha dipping powder. So eat the hamacha first and the melons first. Okay guys, so this is our last one of course. And I'm super excited to try it. It smells so fresh. No fishing is on. Cheers. Cheers. That just melted apart. It has like a bit of a kick to it. It has a little bit of spice. <laughs> mm. Wait, what a fun little twist on melon, but also the, the zing of that, the carbonation that it has in there, it's just tucked away, it just makes everything just kind of vibrant and pop. So this one is just a little snack on the side. For this, what you're going to do is just dip the veggies into our red miso paste there. All the way back here will be a multi-grain rice chip, break it for that one. The flowers you don't need this decoration. Okay, <laughs> So that's up. All right, well, this is not for the meal, no, sadly. No, but but it's really pretty. Mm -hmm. oh, it's over. No. Um, I hate it. These ones are really good. Oh, oh no, it's cold. <laughs> like all the other Toro, and this is this Toro. That's how I vibe, right over here. <laughs> Thank you, Judy. Oh. We have our first hot horse. This is the Dungeness Crab, I believe, with a mushroom, shiitake mushroom. Oh. It's got a nice chew to it. And the warm egg underneath, uh, it's a perfect wintertime like, snack. Um, I'm also, fun fact, allergic to crab, so. so Mm -hmm. Might be bad manners, but I have my mind Okay, so we have the big ear. This was recommended to us by our server because we actually never tried this dish. It's brand new at Yukio. Mm. Oh, well. It's so good. It's important to try new things in life, and this is worth that try. Didn't expect that. So my family is from Hong Kong and this really tastes like the crackling pork that you can get at like a lot of Hong Kong delis. 
Yeah, it still has that almost bacon like quality where you can taste that it's pork. Yeah. There's so much juiciness to it. It's it's amazing. It's really cool like this is a bar. I don't know what they are at all. Right? Edible, right? This one will be the Black Angus beef tuck. And then on the side is actually my favorite uh, sauce that we have, the lemon kosher scallion sauce. Oh. some of these new earrings. I think these are from, I'm gonna have to link them below. I really don't remember. And then I have this handmade cute little like bow uh, rose accessory. They're super popular right now. So I had to do that. And then a comfy like leather jacket with another very comfy like dress, slip dress underneath. And that one is from Alala. So I'll certainly link that below because it's so good. 
I actually have a code, so I'll make sure to give you guys a discount because I got this on sale and it's so cute, super comfy. And then my shoes are from, where are they from again? Oh yes, Blowfish Malibu. So that is the full fit. Everything will be linked below and let's go inside. 